graders, it's Mrs. Wettstein. This time I'm gonna show you how to play doubles dash. I noticed when I copied it, that start and end did not show up. So you get to decide, do you wanna start here or do you wanna start here? You get to decide when you play. All right, so we're going to play doubles dash. For this game, we need a board and we need a die and we'll need two tokens. Now I didn't put tokens in your bag because I figured you probably can find something round or something small at home, maybe from another game or maybe just coins. If you play with a partner, you'll want them to be different. So if I was playing with, with someone in my family, I would use a penny and a nickel. I'm gonna play just by myself. So I'm just going to use the penny right now. I decided this time I'm gonna start down here. So I put my penny on start, I shake my die, five, one, two, three, four, five. I got six plus six, that's my double. Well, six plus six, let's see. If I don't know that off the top of my head, then I have to think of a strategy to use. I'm going to use the strategy of counting on. So I put six in my brain and six on my fingers and I go six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. My answer is 12. I got it correct so I get to stay there. If I get it wrong, then I have to go back to where I was on the last turn. Then I shake again. If you're playing with someone in your family, let them have a turn now. I got four. One, two, three, four. What's four plus four? Four plus four is eight. I know that one. If I didn't know it, I could go four in my brain, five, six, seven, eight, using my counting on. I got it correct, so I get to stay there. Remember, if you go too fast and you make a mistake, simply go back to where you were the last turn and then try again. Have fun learning and have a great attitude. High five.